dawn over uh, Fort Clinton. We just, just up tanker and moved out of the bay we were in and we're going to go exploring the uh, West Bay in Port Clinton. Today is absolutely flat calm. I lift the dinghy out of the water and, and, and have it alongside the boat like that. And uh, it saves the drag. We've been going about uh, an hour and a half now just motoring up here. It's uh, huge. Just getting into the mangroves uh, now. Been mangrove line. We're just going to keep going up. Got two lures out the back. I'm hoping to catch something. With the shadow on the river, it's very hard to pick out the channel. Being to the top of the creek, as far as I wanted to go anyway, I was only a metre, I ran aground, that would have been about 700 of water under me. And now I'm going, making my way out of the creek with the tide. I'm doing uh, about 4.8 knots, I think I've got about half a knot to a knot of tide under me at the moment. Uh, the banks are starting to dry out. and. Uh, Luckily for me, I've got a uh, professional crab fisherman that's uh, working up here, so he's put his pots out, and basically, they're my channel markers. Yeah, well, I've just run aground twice now, trying to find my way out of this place. But I think it's down this bank. I was in the middle, and there was no water there at all. Not even... It took me quite a while to get off. But I think we're uh, in the channel now. It must be down this edge. I don't think anybody's on board. I was going to buy a crab off them. Just go and say hello if anybody's there. No, nobody's there. beach in the center of the uh, film there is the one we were on this morning and uh, this is West Beach over here right on the corner West Point big sandbank in front I'm gonna hope to uh, Bring me board up in a minute and skirt over the top. Just gonna scrub the boat now. It's, uh, there's just a little bit of weed on it. I found this turtle, uh, it was high and dry when I first came and it was covered in, uh, in barnacles so 
I thought I'd do him a favour and I'd clean him off. So I've cleaned him off. I've cleaned off Henry the turtle here, and uh, he's ready to uh, be stream streamlined now. Well, Stratos is uh, finally afloat, and uh, I'm off to. Uh, I think we've basically I've done as much I want to do in uh, Port Clinton. I'm going to go to Island Head uh, tonight uh, with the tide. North Bay in uh, Port Clinton. Uh, it's great when you're any, anywhere, anything from the north, that's a great spot to anchor. I was going to anchor there and I'm not sure yet. I'm just going to poke my nose up round the point and see how much tide will take me up to uh, Island Head Creek because it's only 10 miles. And uh, it's, it's just half past four o'clock. If I can get six knots, I'll carry on. Just going to go into Pearl Bay. It, uh, it says it's a delightful anchorage. There's one more boat in there, I can just see it. Great. arrived in Pearl Bay it's a great place be very picturesque I hope in the morning sunset over uh, Island Head anchored at Pearl Bay Had a great day. We went for, we went in the morning. We got up at six and went in with the tide. Went all the way down for about uh, about ten miles down a creek to the end, till I could uh, till there's only 800 of water, and then I turned around and came back out again, and then uh, dried my boat out on the on a on just on the last couple of hours of the tide, and. Uh, cleaned it and while I was there I saw a stranded turtle so I uh, took all the goose barnacles off him and gave him a spring clean. I hope he was happy.